Houston, say again, please. Uh, Houston, we've had a problem. Hey there folks, welcome you all to part 59 of Elden Ring on the PlayStation 5. We are exactly where we were at the end of the last part, people. Wearing our skins here. And our pointy cheesy what's it hat still. Actually, we've got all of the Godskin stuff on, as opposed, uh, just apart from the hat, because the hat that we have on gives us three int. So there's no point taking it off. We'll run around this for a bit. It's a bit of a change of... Uh, we've been wearing the same sodding armour just about all game. Apart from the academy armour for a little bit. Gowns, I should call them. Right, I did a little bit of a Google just to see if there is, in fact, at this point in time, any way to reach the top of this tower. Or we can reach the, the door, anyway. Anyway, it's a divine tower, people. I should have understood that. And a lot of you might have actually put comments in by now. But... Uh, I'm recording this part immediately after I recorded the last part. And it does say that you need to fight uh, Radan, I think. Uh, Storm Scourge, or whatever his name is. Uh, and get the great rune from that that main story boss fight first. And then that door should open a lift that you go up. So, we can't do it just now. So, we've done everything we can in... Well, we've done everything that I wanted to read up on, anyway. <laughs> and all the other little bits I could see without reading too much. Because uh, I don't like spoilers too too much, people. So, uh, it seems to be that we did basement, we did center. And it was just the top that was left. But I'm sure somebody might shout out to me that there is somewhere else to go. You can always uh, give me some hints and tips if you think I've missed items or something in that sort of bit where you were dropping down on ledges and everything. So, what we're going to do is we are going to go back to... I think it's this one isn't it dragon barrow west and we are going to go uh why right, okay there's a couple of things here that i think that's where the big guy is there so it might be worth going to see what's going on over there first that was uh that was the other bit yeah that was the minor road tree and we were looking over t I think I think if our bearings are right so we're going to go and look at those bits first have a little good look around this section that dark section there as well looks like it could be a cave might not be though and then we'll come up here where the dragons are and see what's what we're there see what's what not overly sure other than being lighter I don't think I'm getting much benefit from this armor to be fair yeah I mean it's only holy that goes down I'm as well putting the other armor on as long as it doesn't take me over which it might do no it doesn't so I think we'll just put that back on for now It would just be nice to pick something up that was better than what I was wearing. For a mage. I mean, what have I done now? Best part of 70 odd hours and I'm <laughs> still wearing the gear from the beginning of the game, for fuck's sake. Right. Might keep the cuffs on though. Omen killer long gloves. Oh, that's a good point actually. Did my robes not have focus on them? Is that not one of the reasons I kept them on? Yeah, they have got high focus. Um. Again, the astrologer trousers, just everything on them is better apart from holy. And a bit heavier. Back to where we started. Back to where we started. Oh well, using the gloves. Right, let's get going, people. 
Hey, well that's number three that we're heading towards there, which is straight ahead of us. Uh, time for a bit of an adventurer's episode. Now there was things lurking in this area that were not particularly friendly, so let's be careful. Yeah, we've got more of those fecking dog things kicking around up here. This isn't where I came from, is it? It just doesn't feel like it. Got to watch for these fecking black birds as well that are sitting on branches because I, it's often that I, I miss them and they're a fecker to sort out. Seriously, look goat, you leave me alone and I'll leave you alone, alright? Dude, seriously. Stop that now. Fucking hell, how much magic? No, I need to drink it now, because if I get into a fight with one... For fuck's sake, what is with these fucking goats, man? That's it, I'm fucking slaughtering your entire kind. Goat soup for dinner, people. Oh, hang on. Got another pointy... Is that another pointy thing? Or is it just a tree? No, it's just a tree. I thought it was one of those statues that point at something. Ooh, there's a sight of grace up here. Fucking goats. Why have I run out of fucking magic as well? What's happening with my magics? It doesn't always fire. Get a decent amount of points out of those badges though. Hey, got myself a little trader here as well. Isolated merchant shack. Oh, for fuck's sake. Are you kidding me on? Get to feck. Fucking goat, try to interrupt me while I'm taking me notes. What's that all about? Right, I don't particularly want to rest. I don't want to reactivate all that shit. There's another one down there. Look. It seems, seems to be that the goats are friendly with those big feckers. Don't know why, but they are. It's been an age since I've seen a customer. How can I help here at the end of the earth? What's going on with this guy? He's not even got a face. He's got a bloody... <laughs> big cloth over his face. 
Well, he sells all sorts of things. Uh, oh, spiked what? Spiked Kestis. Causes blood loss buildup. Nice. I assume if... Yeah, passive effect. So if something... Presumably if something hit... Uh, well, I'm assuming if that's if something hits you... Oh, no, wait a minute. It's a fist It's a fist weapon. Yeah, sorry. It looked like shoulder things for a minute there. Oh, that's a samurai. He's got the samurai kit. The character I nearly went as and we're all thankful I didn't. Uh, note hidden cave. Note gateway. A note sold by Nomadic Merchant contains information about a gateway. Further details are available only when only to paying customers. Well, we could buy the two notes and then look at them, I suppose. Gravel stone. Material used for crafting items found in the lands of ancient dragons. Such compound stones found in lands. I'm starting to feel like... Uh, but it says crafting items, not upgrading equipment. Yeah, they're not under stones, are they? So I'm less excited about them now. Lost Ashes of War. Unable to apply any kind of affinity in their current state, but can be used by smithing Master Hugh of the Round Table to hold... Uh, a round table hold to recreate other ashes. All oh, right, okay. I thought you had to go on the mausoleums for those. Wonder if this is an addition. Thus, does the copy pass into becoming a the genuine article? Interesting. So you can buy two of those from him. And it, the guy there seems to be able to do them for you. Copy the ash of war. Oh yeah, I might be getting confused. It's not copying Ashes of War I'm talking about, is it? Is it? I think the mausoleums copy the the rune or whatever it is you get, the great rune maybe, something like that. Anyway, I don't need that just now. Have a safe journey. Thank you. Well, yeah, I don't know what that's all about. Why have I got a marker there? All oh, right, I've already been down there. That must have been what was underneath the. Uh tower, because it'd definitely be underneath the tower. So we don't need to worry about that. Oh, fucking hell. I can't seem to see a way down there, can I? Ooh, you little badger. Sky shot. I think that big dude down there was trying to shoot at me, the big... Where's he gone? There was a big guy there, <laughs> guarding the road. Oh, he's there. Yeah. 
I... I also feel like that's going to be some kind of quest, and even if I get up there, I'm not going to be able to get in at the moment. It's possible you come out of another cave or something, because I can't see a path to this. I can jump down from there, though. Yeah, we've been over there. And that was the bit that seemed to be blocked for going up there. I don't know a lake. I do not know how we get down there. Mind you, that said, it does look like that's the... That looks like a path that will go round to it, doesn't it? And we've actually been across there, according to this. Minor Erd Tree Catacombs. Yeah, that that's the bit that we couldn't get across there. Oh yeah, of course it is, yeah. Of course it is. Fuck me! Just killed me in one fucking hit, just about. Fucking hell. All because the fucking rock got in the way. Ugh. And now all the enemies are back. On the upside, we died right behind the hut. And the weather's a bit nicer. Fucking fucker. better jump down there somehow. Seems a bit far at the minute. Fuck. What's happening? What's after me? Right, what's happening? There's something... I can hear something. fuck was that all about? Right, I feel like I'm making hard work of this. Because I've already been over here. Yeah, we didn't do these ruins, did we? 
I gave him a hard pass, if I remember rightly, because, uh... Hmm... Oh, I remember why. There was those massive things guarding the, uh... Go on, let's have a little bit of uh, sword fight action, shall we? Fuck me. This is a nasty ass place, this. Uh, okay. Ow. Move. Oh my fucking lord. Oh my fucking lord. Right, okay, what's happening? What's happening? What's happening? These guys... I see, it's the old self-exploding enemies. Got ya. Okay. Well, it went a lot better than it could have done. <laughs> like how all the flames have gone out. It must have been them hiding underneath with the flaming bodies. Yeah, those feckers there, those green things were what made me run for it. Well, it would be a melted mushroom. It was on fire. Yeah, that looks nasty. Yeah, not getting too much in the way of uh, points off of these guys, which is a bit disappointing. Fucking hell, it's littered with them, isn't it? On the upside, we do have enough damage on the sword to take them out before they explode. Like carrying mushrooms in their pockets, don't they? That's his das. Oh, it's one of those big pot things. Well, it's a big green globe thing. I don't know if it what it actually is. I can only assume you can actually blow them up, maybe. But I tried to shoot one, and it just didn't do much damage whatsoever. Oh, it's a big cannon thing. That's why. I got you. Well, that went well.
If I knew what they were weak against, is there, can I sneak up on them and do something to their rear? Oh, thank you. So I can kill the guy that's riding it. Ah. Right, I've got their bloody number. <laughs> Someone's probably screamed that at me at a previous episode now. I've, I've recorded quite the bit. I think this is the fifth part I've recorded since I posted up the first lot of this lump. Well, there's sure as hell going to be a big bunch of fiery jobbers come out of this section, I'm sure. However, I was sure there was another green badger up here to deal with first. Some seriously creepy-ass music in this section, for fuck's sake. Yeah, I can hear it clunking around. Hmm, there's a pickup over here, though. There we go. Well, a nice smouldering butterfly. I do love a smouldering butterfly. Excuse me while I swap 7-up tins. One is empty. Right, well, there's the big green jobber that I was looking at. Yeah, he's tucked himself in a corner, isn't he? <laughs> Little bastard. There's no way I'm getting to that one. Well, I suppose I could tease him out. My fucking lord. Is that three of those big feckers as well? It is, look. Well, that's not ending anyway well, is it? Ah, there's a little tunnel here. Oh, you're kidding me on a boss. Fucking hell, really? Mind you, we've got... Yeah. It's not going to be fucking easy, though, is it? <laughs> not in this area. We've got 11,000 souls. Yeah, so fucking hell. That's a bit of a run back, isn't it, that? Uh...
Only problem is I don't know if I've got enough blue on to activate me summon until I get in there. Oh my lord, what the fuck? Fuck me! What the shit? Well, they're getting slaughtered if I don't get my shit together. Oh, fuck off, you bastard. Fuck. They're both after me now. Fucking hell. Wrong one, Steve. That was a waste. Oh, you bastard! Oh, you bastard! <laughs> oh, no! I don't believe it. I nearly fucking Adam as well. Son of a bitch. Oh, I don't believe that. That is a fucking pain in the... Well, actually, it's not that much of a pain, is it? you just got to sneak your way back around, I suppose. Son of a bitch. Fucking hell, he's only two hits away from having him there. Yeah, that's the problem, innit? you got to get those fuckers out of the way. Although I could probably sprint past them, but... What an idiot. What a fucking idiot. I fucking lost me bearings entirely. I've got no fucking clue where I am. Well, there was that one. I'm pretty sure it was... Well, it just doesn't matter what happens now. It's just, I mean, I suppose getting in there and getting my souls back. But whatever happens now, I've lost fucking loads of health for that fight. Why can't I fathom where that fucking set of steps was?
Oh, excuse me. Yeah, it was definitely here. I don't know why the fuck I couldn't see it from where I was. Right, well that's annoying because I've lost a health, but anyway, let's see how we go. Unbelievable. They've paid no fucking attention to these guys at all. Ah, oh, yeah, fuck off, fuck off. It's just never fucking ending stamina bars. They don't even have to take a break. It's like, you just keep fucking whacking you until you go down. It's twice I've nearly had those fuckers. Right, I think my best route here is to go around the outside. Oh, fuck off. It's because I stood up in it. It's all about the fucking roll in this one. Really, Steve?
Oh, yeah, fucker. Fuck off, you. Woo! All is shit. Yeah, I was expecting a bit extra from points there, but never mind. Bizarre shield. Fucking hell, that's an ugly as fuck thing, isn't it? Well, uh, I do keep forgetting about my old uh, special move on my sword. I'm just wondering if I've got enough. I don't think I have though. I think I used them all for selling, didn't I? Yeah. Not quite got enough for uh, leveling up yet. Emits a voice that says apologies. What? Prattling pate apologies. When the fuck did I pick that up? Tell you what, it's a good job we upgraded those, uh... What do you call them? I'm actually thinking it's better to teleport back and... Just run around the outside again as it happens. Only because there's a fire thing behind me right enough, but... Yeah, he saw me. Right, there's a big fuck-off bird up there. I don't want to noise that up. Oh, there's actually a pickup up there. Well, he's decided to come out. Which, in actual fact, might help me somewhat. Oh, well, actually, no. I was going to go round him, but those fucking dogs are there. Yes, well, of course, there's flaming guys here as well. What the fuck's going on here? They're all getting a bit carried away, are they not? Fucking hellfire. What's happening? <laughs> How did he end up down there?
Well, I could have sworn that there was another one. Here's a question. Why have I got uh, full magics and everything? Except from killing these badgers. Yeah, it must be. Uh... Well, that's got us 20,000 or so. Getting 25 from these guys, really? Got a road going down there. Oh, fucking hell. It's one of those cannons behind me. Well, there's a massive fucking bird thing up there, which I'm never going to beat. I think I've beaten one in my entire fucking life. I think they're also fast as feckery, so it's not like... not overly sure how easy it is to run away from them. Well, if anything, we're better off going south and seeing what's up at that castle, I think. It's bound to be... Well, I'm saying that as long as the bird don't come after me. They generally don't... I'm going to hex it now. They generally don't bother you if you stay really fucking far away from them. But. Oh. Well, that was a pleasure. Let's do that again soon. There's a little camp over there. I get the feeling these guys are going to be harder than they look. Yeah, I thought he was going to be a bit of a fucker as it happens. Magic shield.
Oh yeah, fucker. Oh fucking hell. I knew there was going to be a sight of grace somewhere. I found it while I'm in the middle of a fight. Where's he gone? Has he gone back home? Yeah, it looks like it. creeping up to a level up, which is why I'm kind of... Well, I'm saying that. I mean, it's... Yeah, another 4,000, which we could get from these guys if we're careful about it. I could... Yeah, I could backstab him. He looks a bit nasty with that fucking sword, though. Really, Steve? One hit fucking took him out. Got 500 or so from uh, him, I think. So another one of those frustrating ones. I don't have anything to top it up with. I need to kill... Well, do you know, it'd be easier to teleport back to... Which one was it? That one. <laughs> Just ride up and kill those guys a couple of times and then level up and come back. Also, we need to come back here and fight these dragons if we're going to go for it. Where are we in the grand scheme of that? Yeah, that that is the old crone, isn't it? I think. Oh no, that's the old crone. Smouldering wall is what we're at. Street sage ruins. Remember those. I mean, if we actually do this twice, I think. Oh, fucking hell, Steve, steady. Really? <laughs> and he takes you to drop them again. There must be about 100 drops down there. Come on now. Oh, that's another thing as well, I didn't I actually? I mean, I know I've been down to the bottom, but... I don't think we invested... We never did drop down there to see what was what, did we? Maybe do that after this, just to see. What the... That was a bit weird. He seemed to be in a strange position, that... There he goes. <laughs> Oof. Yeah, like one or two more of those, and that's, uh, that's just got a level up.
I'm still wreathing from losing my fucking points for that boss fight. I'm going to assume the drops do actually, uh, no, he's not even on that ledge now. The drops do vanish when you respawn. Well, rest, you know what I mean. Yeah, that should do it. 26,000. Indeed, by a, by not much, but it does do it. <laughs> Runes needed two five nine three one, two six zero oh, five nine is what we have. Thirty six intelligence time, people. Level sixty seven. Now here's something I'm just going to test, because. I feel like we must be able to take these guys down in three hits now, whereas it, up until now it's taken us four. Let a smidge of health left every time we hit them. Now that extra int should have upped our magic to a point where it's going to take them down in three. Yay! <laughs> Finally! <laughs> Finally! Admittedly, the first one's probably a surprise shot, but... Yeah. Superb. So, well, we've nothing to lose now, so let's just have a little donder down here. At least I can't remember coming here. I think you can navigate your way down. I could be wrong. Could be entirely wrong, in fact. Well, yeah, that's a ladder going up. Oh, maybe that's where I did come in the first place. Yeah, I think I'm talking bollocks, people. I think this is where we actually did come in the first place. But I feel like there was a way down that I could have investigated. There's no way we're making that drop, though, is there? Certainly not. And there's no way of making that jump either. Well, not as a human. Oh, for fuck's sake. Really? For fuck's sake. Anyone would think it was difficult for a horse to, you know, walk along a ledge. Anyway, right, I think that's probably enough. Uh, I could have sworn there was a... I mean, we did go down to the bottom, but... And there was all those pickups at the bottom. I just feel like there's ledges we've not been on further down. Like that, that midsection there, I'm not convinced we've been on. And there must be a way to it. Well, maybe that was the path we took round. Because there's the path that we took round. Round. 
And the last thing I want to do is noise these dragons up. Not in this part, anyway. <laughs> We've definitely been down there, though. Anyway, I wander aimlessly, people. Where the hell's it put me souls? My runes, even. Yeah, I don't know why I was thinking I hadn't been down on that ledge before. Well, I'll tell you for why, because I... Uh Yeah, because I normally just jumped over onto the... off of this. This Y. That's a different ledge, isn't it? No, it's not. That's where I used to jump down. Well, look where it's put me fucking runes. Seriously, what the fuck? How am I meant to get them? And even if... <laughs> All right. So the question is, can you land on this little ledge here? Rather than... Uh, for fuck's sake. All right, don't land on the big ledge. Land on the little ledge. Thank you. Looking for knights round corners here. I'm pretty sure I've not been round this side. Oh, maybe I have. A dead end. I seem to recall a dead end at some point. I've not been down there, though. I'm not seeing any pickups down there, though. Which would suggest that maybe you're not meant to be down there. see anything worth picking up or anything down here. Well, anything at all to pick up, to be fair. <sighs> Wherever there's ledges, though, I feel frustrated that I can't walk on them. Right. Let's not... Let's not waste the four and a half thousand we've got. Well, okay. I think that's probably an ideal place to wrap it up. Now, hit the hour mark, people. We've got a fair bit. We've got a fair bit covered. I'm not sure if I'm liking this area or not. I mean, I'm still enjoying when I get into the boss fights or when I get into the little linear areas. I'm not particularly enjoying the out outside world of this area. I'm finding it a bit... Well, the music's really fucking creepy all the time, which is just not a great ambience to wander about in for long spells of time. <laughs> anyway, I... Uh, and I don't know, it may be because I'm slightly underpowered for a lot of these enemies. I mean, it's taken me, out, like, how much of a, a whole health bar, or, sorry, a whole magic bar just to take one fecking dog down, or... Um, those birds are a nightmare. So I'm just avoiding the shit out of them. I mean, that's Souls games, though, isn't it? There's an argument that says just get on with Redmain, but there is a... When I did see a little note on it, uh, to see where Blyde went next, it did say that the boss in here was the toughest anyway I've got the dragons to fight uh, we got to the, um, the that's the last place we went to smoldering wall so I guess we've got to check out those ruins that are near it as well Street of Sages Ruins. Keep a note of those for the next part. 
And the next part, people, is part 60. Can you believe it? Holy shit. Well, there you are, folks. Superb. We're still we're still getting the bosses done. I mean, they are they are tougher in this area, and it's taken me a number of attempts. But we are getting there, people. We are getting there. It has been an honour and a privilege serving for you once again in Elden Ring on the PlayStation Five. And I'll catch you in the next one, folks. Take it easy. Bye.